Hi students, now we are going to solve the fourth sum in the exercise. A 150 watt lamp emits light of mean bare length of 5500 angstrom unit. If the efficiency is 12%, find out the number of photons emitted by the lamp in one second. Now the actual power of the lamp is given as 150 watt. But what is its efficiency is given as 12%. That means only 12% of this given power is utilized for emission of photons. So we will write the given quantities first. The wavelength of the light is 5500 angstrom minute. The actual power of the lamp is 150 watt. But the effective power utilized for the photoelectric effect is only 12% of 150 watt. That is uh, 0.12 into 150 is 18 watt. 18 watt power only is utilized for photoelectric emission. Now, we have to find the number of photons emitted per second. So, if capital N is the total number of photons emitted and T is the total time, then N by T is denoted by small n, where small n is called the number of photons emitted per second. Now, we will first find the energy of a single photon. Energy of a single photon. So that is equal to what? Hc by lambda. So we have studied E is equal to H nu, isn't it? That is Hc by lambda. There is the energy of a single photon. So this has to be determined. So this is equal to H is Planck's constant. So this is 6.625 into 10 power minus 34 joule second into C is the velocity of light. That is what 3 into 10 power 8 whole divided by this can be written as 5.5 into 10 power minus 7 also. So this also can be written as 5.5 into 10 to the power of minus 7 meter. So I will write here as 5.5 into 10 power minus 7. So now we have to find the product using the calculator. Okay, so 6.625. 6.625 multiplied by 3. So multiplied by 3. So this is now equal to energy of a single photon. That is equal to 19.875. 19.875 divided by 5.5 into. So here 10 power minus 7 in the denominator comes up as a plus 7. So 8 plus 7 is 15. So this is a into 10 power minus 34 into 10 power plus 15. So this is now equal to. So I will divide this number by 5.5. So that value is 3.61. So this is 3.61 into 10 power 34 minus a. 15 okay so 10 power minus 34 and the plus 15 is equal to 10 power minus 19 so this is uh, the energy of a single photon now we have to find the total number of uh, photons emitted per second so the power p okay the power p that is equal to 18 watt 18 joule per second is equal to n times uh, this energy, n times this energy, that is a 3.61 into 10 power minus 19 joule, okay, per second, because n is what, number of photons emitted per second, is it not, its unit is per second, and the energy is a joule, so left side power is a in watt, so 18 watt is written as 18 joule per second, and n per second into 3.61 into 10 power minus 19 joule, so on both sides, sir, now you see that uh, n, therefore uh, n, n is equal to this 18 divided by 3.61 into 10 power minus 19. So we have to find uh, this ratio. 18 has to be divided by 3.61. 
so 18 divided by 3.61 so this is equal to 4.986 so this is 4.986 into 10 power this minus 19 is coming as what a plus 19 so this is the required answer so the number of photons emitted per second is what the 4.986 into 10 to the power of a 19 photons so first we have to understand the problem though the given power is 150 watt out of this efficiency is given only 12 percent so here only you should be very careful in analyzing the problem so 12 percent of 150 watt we have found as 18 watt okay this only is utilized for the number of photons electric emitted per second so after that the energy of one photon we have to find out and then we have to multiply by the total number of photons emitted per second so we get the answer as n equal to 4.986 into 10 power 19 photons i hope you must have understood the fine